I'm a crack now, sit your ass down. I got stuff I never had now. I could brag now. Yeah, my niggas, they gon' spend. You try to rip it packs, wasting money, not getting anything in return. Well, visit BobMuckCoins.com and use promo code JMail for 10% off to get the God Squad you always wanted. What's good, YouTube? Bring y'all another Madden 17 Nano Blitz today. Yes, we dropping two blitzes today. Both post patch heat for y'all. It's just it's basically the same thing. I just uploaded as Nickel Blitz. A lot of people are like, what about I got Nickel Normal, Nickel 35? I got I like to use Big Down 236. Slant Zone 2. I honestly think this screams more. The nickel normal, but it's really I, I don't know. I don't know because I just I just like big diamond because now you got four DBs on the field instead of three. And a lot of people uh like to who like it if you like to use dollar with four DBs, you can go straight to big diamond two three six without having to worry about you know what I'm saying? Because a lot of people even if you make a salary cap team or draft champs, if you only got three like you only got a team for nickel, you got three good corners and not really nobody else. I say use nickel normal if you like to run dollar. Then I would say you can mix this in with dollar because you got 40 B's and like like I said, it's just easier that way. But I'm gonna show y'all this blitz. It's almost the same thing, but all you want to do, uh, all you want to do is base a line, pinch your D line, crash to the outside. Then you're gonna hit R B, and then you're gonna uh hit re blitz this guy right here, this linebacker. So you get R B right on the right stick, but you don't have to do that. Y'all know the, the original slant zone too. Like, but now it's the same thing as the nickel norm. The original slant zone two, you didn't have to re blitz him. You can cross man. You're like, yo, there's no coverage on the field. Uh, duh. Like, you're not sending six every time. But basically, you want to do something like this. Uh, now, if you want to send it from the left, you can start cross manning these guys on the right, just like the nickel normal. Uh, like, you can do something like that. If you want to send it from the right, uh, basically, you don't have to re blitz that guy. But I, I like sending it from the right because it's almost unblockable because this guy is like come from depth like this. And like, it's, it's, it's almost unblockable guys like i said this is the same thing as the nickel blitz guys like we coming out in y'all like okay what's the setup base line pinch your d line crash to the outside and then you're gonna hit rb this guy you're gonna blitz right here this is guy in the zone if you want to send it from the right you can leave it sitting from the right and then you can cross man these guys and do that and but all you want to do is come over here uh some people like to hover here it's, it really depends on what y'all like to do like I said, I don't like hovering on that right tackle because y'all see how easy the blitz get picked up. But like I said, make sure you got the right personnel in the game. But like I said, base line, pinchy line, crash to the outside. Uh, I like that. But the next setup, all you're going to do is blitz this, re blitz this guy. And now you can choose what side you want to send pressure from. If they block in there running back to the left, what I would do is just send it from the right. That's what I usually do. I'm like, okay, he's blocking running from the left. So let's start cross banning these dudes. Boom, boom, boom. Then we can spy that dude, whatever. But usually it's really up to y'all like it depends on where he wants to send pressure from like because a lot of people be like okay then then not what you gonna do okay let me just block my running back to the left right all right let's block your running back to the left so now we're gonna do the same set of baseline pinchy line boom boom but now we're just gonna send pressure from the right i'm like okay his running backs over there like because you know we, we want to just try to play mind games with them y'all like yo this is a lot to do like yeah it's a, it is a lot to do y'all like it's a lot to take in like i'm i'm not joking y'all it's a lot to take in and it's hard so that's why i tell y'all make sure y'all lab these blitzes so you can get used to sending it and cross man from the left and the right so like i said y'all see right there with a pressure or what he i don't know he low-key got picked up that's why i say you want to have somebody fast or like hey you only got like 86 speed but like i said okay now he's what you gonna call so now if he's got his running back block to the left we're gonna send pressure from the right but like i said it's up to y'all uh mainly i don't like the pinch that's what a lot of people like to do i like the base line shift my line shift my line to the right and then crash right if, if i want to get guaranteed pressure in there you know what i'm saying like this and then i can cross man like this uh i and a boom 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 but then that will almost get you guaranteed pressure off that edge so that's what y'all want to do so like i normally a lot of people say pinch because pinching helps stop the run i will say that like I said, in salary cap, you got the right players. I would say pinch the line. Like I said, if I want to send it from the left, base the line, I would shift my line to the left, crash to the left, and then re blitz that guy to the left, and then cross man the people on the right. Because a lot of people are like, okay, he's just going to send slant zone two again. No, you're not. You know what I'm saying? But like I said, because a lot of people see slant zone two, like, okay, here it comes. Let's block it from the right. But no, 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 sir. No, sir. Now we still screaming from the left. Like I said, make sure if y'all got mud, y'all got the right people in to make these adjustments. Like I said, it's really up to y'all what y'all can do. And sometimes I like to send everybody just like that. And you usually get double edge heat off the both sides. I'm not joking, y'all. Like, this blitz can be nasty. Base the line pinch. Uh, do that. Do that. And you usually get double edge heat. Just hover over the line. A scrimmage. Hold R. And boom. Y'all see? 
I got stopped in the gap. Like I said, it's basically like a nickel blitz. If y'all don't believe me that, that this blitz works, a lot of y'all, this is not a blitz to run for a bunch of people. A lot of y'all, if y'all don't really know how to make adjustments, just stick to the old slant zone setup and, you know, baseline doing this. Whatever, you know what I'm saying? Do whatever y'all need to do. But for a lot of y'all, if y'all really want to take our game to the next level, I would say get used to, uh, I would say get used to sending, sending pressure from the both sides because if you can send pressure from both sides like okay he got his running back to the left let me send it from the right boom he got his running back back to the right let me send it from the left y'all can really like do damage and y'all think i'm joking like i said and who who got me with this blitz i know a lot a couple people who run this blitz to watch on twitch you want to use watch ghost madden ghost madden i know he runs it to perfection uh pony was running against me who else runs slant zone too i don't know too many people that run slant zone. skimbo runs it uh i know a lot of people run a nickel normal but it's really up to y'all like Sending pressure from both sides is so key in this game, and it's it's, it's low key ridiculous. Like, I really I really hate this blitz because when I ran into it, it's just it just dumbfounded. Like you can, like I, I don't even know what they'll say. But like I said, hope y'all enjoy this blitz. Make sure y'all making adjustments and make sure y'all are freaking what you call. Make sure y'all are freaking actually labbing this blitz and learning how to make adjustments. And please, 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 please. please. Please make sure y'all not spamming it and make sure y'all learn. If y'all gonna learn how to use this new slant zone too, like y'all ask me for post patch heat, bro. The post patch heat is different and complicated. It's not like bum friendly blitzes. It's sending pressure from both sides and it's you. It's up to you which side you want to send it from both sides, left side. You can send it from the right, left, or both. And making adjustments from the right to the left is hard. So make sure y'all learn. Y'all gonna be like, yo, J Mail, this blitz is trash. It takes too long to set up. You need to learn. Like, y'all asking for post patch heat. This is the best post patch heat I can give y'all. Like, uh, just just go watch Goss, True Boy, Pony. Uh, even though I don't really want to say this, Joe. Joe don't really blitz though. Watch Problem, AKG. I'm telling y'all, these blitzes are disgusting. But like I said, hope y'all enjoyed this video. Like, comment, subscribe. But until then, it's your boy J Man Flow, aka Mr. Let's Get It. Let's go.